here. Oh, he's a pretty one. Oh, yeah. Both hooks. I'm gonna show you what I'm using for bait. I'm actually using sand flames right now. Um, and I did parboil these for about five seconds before I froze them. Uh, a gentleman told me about it. I figured I'd give it a shot because I don't believe anything I hear and only half of what I read. So I figured I'd give it a try and it is working. The bite is on fire. I did catch one little sheep's head and And a puffer so some other stuff mixed in here but there are talk talk here I had another big one on it got away yeah they're here so guys these talk talk they they're cold water fish this is about the southern extent of their territory they mostly live up north and they like cold water so that's why we fish for them in the winter time oh yeah they're down there there's a whole school of them down there they're hard to catch they got a small mouth really gotta let them have it using these one aught gamagatsu hooks 4x strong because they are a strong fish you see try to take me up underneath the ramp you better have some strong hooks they'll bend them out There he is. Oh, nice sheep's head. Okay. There's some pretty fish here today. It's December 13th, and we are having fun. The tide's falling right now, so I can smell my bait up underneath that ramp. The tide's pulling it right to him. Bring this whole school of fish into me.
show you the rigs I tie. Grouper knot, two grouper knot, 80 pound test. I like fluorocarbon, but this is mono. They don't seem to mind. Not when they're this hungry. Matters a little bit more in the summertime, but right now they're feeding really aggressively. Um, when this water cools down, they're searching for food. They're trying to stay warm this winter. Just go ahead and put your line through like that up to your swivel and then tie an overhand knot. Try to get this as tight to the swivel as you can. come through fishing like this your fender system had better be on point let me go ahead and tell you
Sharp hooks, folks. You gotta have them. I'll hook them. They'll still eat. down there pretty little fish right in the corner Two forty five, our bait's running a little thin as far as the uh, the par boiled. Jeff's more bait in here. What are these? These are the crabs. Let's try these mud crabs. We got a good incoming tide and we've got a couple more hours to fish. Let's play.
caught these fresh and I froze them alive. So they are, should be good and fresh. Drum. Gotcha. Got him on a sand flea. 